Okay, so far so good. Let's see. Where are you guys going? No work to be found, no money for food. I have no idea. Uh, better hurry up. Losing sight. Well, lost sight, but. The situation is so bad. Okay. Gotta be careful not to get too close. We're also, slowly moving forward. So far, so good. Haven't really had any problems yet. I hope we reach our destination soon. Whatever it may be. There we go. That's something that... Oh, I was moving with them for a time. Uh-oh. Not good. There we go. Oh, what? That was the wrong guy. Why the hell did you kill the wrong guy? Come on. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's all of them. Got them all. Okay, and got full sync on that. That's good. So let's talk to this guy and start the next mission. Ooh, they hung his wife. Was beautiful. <laughs> she was, until that porco defiled her. I wish he just killed her. I wish he just killed La Mia Mata. People nice. who saw her grow up cheered when he spat on her. Smiles on their faces when her neck. I understand. How can you? My Livia was innocent. So was his father I have and lost brother. Family to the rope, to treachery. Il Carnefice watches from his home on the hill above. He threatens to hang me if I cut her rope. <laughs> well, let's go deal with him. When you are ready, take her down. Kill target with I the hidden blade. With I believe that was a full sink requirement. A lot of them are fairly simple, but it kind of does force you to play the game a certain way. It forces you to play the game the way the developers wanted you to play it rather than the way you want to play it. And also sometimes it can be a, a bit tough or ridiculous, especially when you have NPCs around you, because sometimes they do things that are contrary, tra that, contrary to... What you're supposed to do nice for a full sink. Uh, not my best, but it's hard to make art with poor materials. There we go. Done. Requiescat in pace. Got him. Not entirely pivotal to the story, so that's why there's no exposition here. Actually, he's not really pivotal to the story at all. Ow. Ah, come on. I was gonna say, how do I break out of that? Not good. There we go. Oh yeah, there we go. And there is some uh, loot here, so let's grab that. Heal up a little before heading on to our next mission somewhere this way. Let's see. Okay, I, I want to make sure I'm not just jumping down into nowhere. 
Ooh, loot. Ay, 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 ay. Ooh, so close. Eh, I don't care about the loot. It's not worth it. This ain't Diablo. Okay. So are we finally getting to Machiavelli or what? Or are we going back to the husband to let him know he can cut his wife down? This mission's kind of a ways away. Uh oh. Ooh. A little bit of a freeze there. Okay. Ah, Machiavelli it is. Ezio, what a surprise to see you here. I thought you had sent for me. Nope. Never. News of the villa attack has spread across the city. We were certain that you were dead. Not yet. I am still very much alive. Uh-huh. The Borgia must not discover that you escaped them. They will in time. Throw the Borgia captain into the scaffold to kill him. Okay. We'll see if we can't do that then. Follow me. Take care not to draw any undue attention. Uh huh. When do I ever? Yep, the feature that allows you to just walk alongside people like the Machiavelli here without any input from you apparently doesn't come until Revelation, so. You would be wise to purchase missing equipment. You will not live long in Roma without supplies. Uh-huh. Well, right now I only have 410 florins, so... I have my blade. Ah, I do not even have enough for it. And the guards have their guns, courtesy of the Borgia. Fortunately, I can help. Ah, that's good. So what am I supposed to buy here? While you are in my debt, perhaps you will listen to reason. As of? soon as I hear some, I will let you know. Ooh. Buy the stiletto and Roman spalders. Okay. Repair? I can't repair anything. Armor. Roman spalders. There we go. And the stiletto. Better than nothing. So now we have a small weapon, which I almost never use. Repair, but nothing needs repairs. Okay. Come and see me next to pass this way. Then, now you can survive the journey back to Firenze. Perhaps. Uh -huh. But I'm not going to Firenze. Oh. There will be no peace until we rise up against the entire Borgia family and the Templars who serve them. I uh -huh. do not recall such brave talk at Monteregione. How could I have known that they would find me so quickly? That they would kill Mario? Rodrigo surrounds himself with snakes and murderers. Even his daughter Lucrezia has been sharpened into one of his most artful weapons. Oh, really? But she pales in comparison to the man behind the villa attack. He is ambitious, ruthless, and cruel beyond imagining. The laws of men mean nothing to him. He murdered his own brother to take power. He knows neither danger nor fatigue. And his name comes Those from do not fall the title by the sword, of the ancient emperors of Rome. Ranks. The powerful Orsini and Colonna families have been brought to kneel at his feet, and the King of France stands at his side. Give me his name. Cesare, head of the papal armies. What does he intend to do with his power? Don't what drives yet. the man? That oh, there's I loot there, know. and I can't grab but it. But Ezio, Cesare has set his sights on all of Italia, and at this rate he will have it. Is that admiration uh -huh. I hear in your voice? He knows how to exercise his will. A rare virtue in the world today. Well, we'll see how well it works for him once I get my hands on him. Let's see. How much further to our destination, Machiavelli? This is taking forever. Okay, we're almost there. I can tell by the little 
castle sign with the uh, cross, the shielded cross in front of it, or on top of it, whatever, in it. Should we yeah. not travel by horse? Roma is quite large. As Cesare's conquests in Romagna continue to succeed and the Borgia grow in power, they have taken desirable areas of the city for themselves. We cannot use the stables here. Not oh, yet. The will of the Borgia is law now. What are you implying, Ezio? Do not play dumb with me, Machiavelli. Do you have some kind of plan? I am improvising. Yep. Okay. Gotta find him. Grab him. Uh, not good, not good, not good. Uh, why don't we get up top? There we go. Oh, there's no way to get him from here. Oh well. Let's kill the rest of these guys. No, no, no. No. Oh, that's not good. There we go. There we go. Now what do I do? Back to Machiavelli, good. Just because you kill a few guards does not mean the people will grant access to the stables. You are right. We need to send a signal. Wait here. Oh, what signal, though? Ignite the Borgia Tower. Yep. This is how we reclaim the city and unlock areas to buy and expand for the betterment of the city for uh, the economy and so on. Let's see, where's my way up? This will work. Up, oh, wait. I see I see a ladder. We'll go up that. There we go. The Borgia Tower is on fire. And their flags are burning. It seems the stable is now available for purchase. Good. You. We'll buy it and use it. Let's see. What button do I use to buy this? Renovate the stable, it says. But I can't... Ah, there we go. Examine. Upgrade. Yes. This is probably the only building that's actually free. There we go. We now have access to this stable. It's been rebuilt. Don't lose any health. Okay, I will do my best. Keep forgetting it's circle to mount up. Let's see. Let's get closer to him. Oh, not good, not good. What's wrong with you? Sorry, man. Ah, you are an not want to do that. Yeah, Rome is a uh, pretty big place. Like, really big. Let's see if I can... Oh, uh, I had another little freeze up there. Let's see if I can pull up the menu here. I don't know why I'm getting those freeze ups. Or not the menu, the map. So, yeah. There's our stable. This is where we are already. Oops, too far. Okay, this should be all of Rome around here. Tells you how big it is. Let's do this as well, because this will actually show us all the, the different zones. 